the Phoenix Tower project was a pinnacle of achievement for consolidated crane and rigging. Consolidated's innovative approach, experience, and expertise made them the perfect candidate for the job. This chiller changeout project posed a unique set of challenges that arose from a variety of factors such as building height of over 430 feet, restricted size of the job site, unlevel ground conditions, limited window to mobilize the crane, all contributed to the complexity of the job. Crushed concrete was used to overcome the two foot elevation difference between the road and the parking lot. Using such a large crawler crane came with its own challenges. Building the pad and assembly of the crane itself all had to happen in a remarkably tight six-day window. A crane of this size requires ground conditions to be level with a slope of less than one degree. With the two-day window prior to crane arrival, Consolidated brought in over 200 tons of crushed concrete and more than 100 timber mats to build a level pad for the massive crane. The four oversized loads carrying the body of the crane were staged at Consolidated's yard the day prior to delivery. With the aid of police escorts, the trucks arrived at Greenway Plaza at 4 a.m. to avoid interfering with traffic. It was quickly determined that no hydraulic truck crane could make these lifts. Consolidated's out-of-the-box approach was to bring in a 660-ton crawler crane with 590 feet of boom and jib. The decision was made to bear rent the crane from a strategic partner company with a similar expertise in crawler cranes and logistics. Working closely with their technician, Consolidated's experienced foreman and skilled erection crew handled the assembly of the crane from start to finish. Delivering 55 truckloads into the heart of Houston was no small feat. Three assist cranes were positioned around the site to ensure seamless unloading and assembly of the crane. This unique crane configuration required over 1 million pounds of counterweight to raise the boom off the ground.
Another major challenge was to build a 590 feet of boom in a space of only 535 feet, which ended in a covered walkway. To overcome this hurdle, the rigging crew used a man lift to pin the last few boom sections in the air. When it was time to make the chiller lifts, Consolidated turned to one of their veteran operators with decades of experience running large crawler cranes. To limit the risk that comes with working in high winds over 500 feet in the air, Consolidated installed a weather station atop Phoenix Tower to closely monitor wind patterns. Consolidated's turnkey services included storing the chillers at their warehouse months prior to the job. The morning of the lifts, the chillers were delivered to Phoenix Tower. So we're getting ready to take the first chiller out of the roof. As you can see over here, they already got the block dropped down. The guys are on top of the chiller rigging up to it. In position, we're ready to rock and roll. We're here on the top of Phoenix Tower, getting ready to hoist the first chiller out of the hole. It's going to weigh approximately 30,000 pounds. Because we're working near an open hole, everyone around the hole is secured and tied off with harnesses. We're 435 feet up in the air, so we're not taking any chances.
As seen in this time-lapse video of the central plant, Consolidated returned one month after the initial weekend of work to replace the last two chillers. After dismantling the crane and removing the timber mats, the final step was to haul off the crushed concrete and restore the site to its original condition. Consolidated Crane and Rigging would like to say a special thanks to Letso's company and Parkway Properties for working with us the entire way to guarantee the success of this project.